It's 2024, folks. Welcome to the new year. But wait, something's lurking from around the corner. Something that the people at Disney don't want you to see. Mickey Mouse, more specifically, the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse is now in the public domain. Disney doesn't have its grubby little hands all over our Steamboat Willie and his maybe giant penis. <laughs> Steamboat Willie with the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse was released in 1928 and now because of uh, copyright law after 95 years of holding a copyright over something it then goes into the public domain which means that Disney now does not own the rights to that version of Mickey Mouse anymore. We saw this happen a couple of years ago. The copyright for Winnie the Pooh ran out and then we saw stuff like Pooh, Blood and Honey or whatever that movie was. People were now allowed to take that IP and make whatever they want with it without being sued. And so now that is happening with Mickey Mouse. So not only is stuff happening similar to Winnie the Pooh, there are a few horror movies being announced. And no doubt, I'm sure that there's going to be a bunch more. With this, uh, <laughs> they dropped it, I think, right on January 1st. Yep, right on January 1st. I actually haven't seen this. Let's watch it. First ever Mickey Mouse horror film. This is going to be <laughs> so bad. This looks awful. Wait. Guys. It's an angry bird's coin pusher that I'm obsessed with. The real villain in this movie taking money from not only children, but your favorite YouTuber. God, we have to stop them. I want to go back. Yeah, he's like completely in love with me already. Oof. Put the phone down! Put the phone down, please! I'd like to do that. Already stopped. This. Tina, Tina, please! Jane, please! I'll be right back. I thought at least the Blood and Honey good. trailer like looked like kind of fun like, and entertaining. So you never say, I'll be right back. But this looks done. awful. This looks real bad. That little like prop looks cool. But this looks so bad. The mouse is out. <laughs> Where the hell did he go? Man. Mickey Mouse's Mickey's mouse trap. Ah, God. Okay. So <sighs> The original idea for this video was I wanted to look at like public domain memes and look at the memes of Steamboat Willie. But now I have some things that I want to talk about. This to me seems just like an obvious cash grab, which all the right to them to do so. But it does just kind of suck because that that looks awful. It's like, OK, go you guys for being able to take this thing that uh, was previously Disney IP and basically profit from Disney, but at the same time, it f it feels like a blatant cash grab. So this happened with Winnie the Pooh. This movie was made for a hundred thousand dollars, which you might think at first a hundred thousand dollars that's a lot of money. That is zero dollars for making a movie, and gross worldwide it made five million. So it made an insane profit, despite most people thinking. And granted, I did not see this movie. Most people thinking that this movie was absolute garbage and so it looks like that same thing is happening here where they're just like okay the ip is up just make whatever we can make it for dirt cheap and then get a fuck ton of money from it let's see if it already has a oh it does budget 800k 800 i'm not trying to rag on them because it's completely within the right but it does it does set a shitty precedent it doesn't feel like there's any like heart into it again this is all just speculation from me and what i'm seeing just off of that being like wow that looks awful and it looks like they're just trying to gain off of the release of the ip i will probably not see this movie i feel like a lot of people probably will i will be interested to see how things play out because of two things one 
It's Disney. Two, the copyright is up for the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse, but I wonder how specific even just like this mask, like you can obviously tell that it's Mickey Mouse. What's stopping Disney from being like, no, this is not Steamboat Willie Mickey Mouse. That is Mickey Mouse, Mickey Mouse. You know what I mean? Like, I wonder where the line is going to be drawn. And I'm sure that because it's Disney, there's nothing stopping them from fucking suing people out the ass. So that'll be really interesting to see what happens with that how do you differentiate i have no idea corridor digital which i fucking love that channel by the way they uploaded just steamboat willy the fact that they uploaded the whole thing with no edits is kind of awesome like this is fully legal they don't have to jump through any loopholes that's the beauty of public domain this is why so it's just the first it's just steamboat willy in its entirety and they just uploaded it Which is completely legal. <laughs> Next five years of Steamboat Willy content. Just Steamboat Willy and Shrek fucking. <laughs> they made him the driving crooner. See, it, it is really interesting. It's not like copyright stops people from making like memes al already. Again, it, it'll be interesting to see what actually gets made from a show or a movie standpoint and again it does kind of suck it just seems like cash grabs initially but i really hope that at some point people use these ips in a, like a really fun creative way <laughs> steamboat willy minus one <laughs> Shitty horror come in directors. This is not worth standing by. Watch the missile now! <laughs> <laughs> it's exactly right. Because see, it would have been cool if like they wouldn't be able to start production, I imagine, until the copyright runs out. But in theory, it would have been cool if like fucking A24. If Ari Aster made a Steamboat Willy horror movie, they started production like a few years ago, and then they release it. They don't even tease it. They just drop it in theaters on January 1st. God, that would have been sick. Sick. But I imagine that you can't actually start production on something. But it's not being released. So how does that work? Are there any copyright lawyers in the comments? <laughs> Would you need to get the rights to Steamboat Willie or any IP before production? Or can you do production without the rights and then release it once it's public domain? For instance, with music used in movies i'm pretty sure at least you can make an edit with a certain song before getting the rights to it as long as you don't release it without having the rights you know what i mean so can you then go into production on a thing that you don't have the rights for knowing that it's going into the public domain i don't know let me know in the comments if anybody's a lawyer first cartoon together steamboat itchy steamboat itchy did they get in trouble for that this is The Simpsons. While drawing Steamboat Itchy Sequence, the animator strokingly referred to it as Steamboat Lawsuit. I just wanted to talk about... Yes! Yes! Yeah! I thought it was going to be the shot of him with the gun. Um... <laughs> oh, interesting. Steamboat Willie went into public domain on January 1st. However, many creators are experiencing auto copyright claims by Disney for the short. Okay, so Brock Baker put out a dub of Steamboat Willie. Oh, okay. It does say claimed by Disney. A lot of times you'll get a claim for something and it's from a different company and it's a and it's a false claim and they'll just try and claim it until you dispute it. That'll probably be happening for a while because it is um it is an automated system, so it'll just be like, "Okay, we see Steamboat Willie blah blah." blah. Like Disney can be like this is our content like even i can see on my end this is my copyright where it says a content match of things that i have uploaded and then different channels like this is 20 percent of their video 10 percent. this is a hundred percent of their video is my content sometimes i care sometimes i don't somebody uploaded a one hour version of a cover that i did i don't really care so disney can see that and then they can claim a bunch of stuff but a lot of times it is an automated system as well where it'll just auto claim stuff so i imagine that's what's happening so it's probably just going to take a bit for the system to to adjust and be like oh wait we can't claim this thing anymore um but it's also disney so they might just try and get away with it steamboat willie in the public domain this video is was way 
different than I expected it to be. I was going to just look at Steamboat Willie memes. But, you know, we had a conversation about copyright law and my thoughts on people uh, just making shitty horror movies right out the gate. Again, fucking do whatever you want. I don't really care, but I wish that they were a little bit better in my opinion. Let me know what your thoughts are about Steamboat Willie going into the public domain, what you would like to see, what you don't like seeing. And if there's any, uh, if there's any lawyers in chat, uh, you know, leave some comments about copyright law because I don't know anything. All right, I'll see you. Oh, no, no, no!